Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, my name's Rachel, if you're new, and I would love it if you would join my family and subscribe to my channel. Today's video is just going to be a short little Dollar Tree haul, but it's all Halloween related items. I thought I would kind of break it up and not do a huge haul. I would just keep the Halloween and just a couple um, Thanksgiving pieces or fall pieces really and just keep it kind of small. So my favorite out of this whole Dollar Tree trip are these little wooden, kind of wooden, uh, little sign plaque things. I don't know what you call them. They are adorable. Like if you see, they're not real small. Like they're a good size, but this one is Hello Fall. I love this. I think it is so beautiful. And then I also got this one. It says, Welcome Friends. I love these for a dollar. This is amazing. Let me put that one right there. How cute. And then a couple more signs that I got was this one. It says, Come in, my pretties. And it's got the little sparkly purple, black, orange witch hat and the broom. Love this. I also got this one. I love this one, and this is sparkly as well. So cute. I always go crazy with signs, but you can always, like, cut the little string off and put something there to cover the hole and set them in, like, a little um, tray, um, like, book holder or those glass plate holders, and you can just set it up on a shelf, and it'll look super cute, or you can use, like, a 3M hook and just stick it to the wall or whatever. I got these two little craft things. They're the same thing, but that's what it looks like, but it's just, like, a little crafting kit for my kiddos. I got them each one. I also, I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but I just like this. I didn't want to pass it up this year. Um, I think right now my store mainly has like old stuff that they had last year and just a couple little new things. I think they're trying to get like last year's stuff out of the way first. And a few little bags that I got for my daughter's um, class so I can put little goodies in them are this kind and oh I got two of those and I also got this one which are super cute I also got a bunch of this ribbon I want to sh let you guys actually see it I am in love with this this year I am going to do oh I about knocked my camera over this year I just I don't want to be on trend with everybody they're doing like the real neutral palette with the whites and like the light mint teal greens and stuff like that. I don't want to do that. I just, I want to be traditional. I want to use the orange and the black. I, I don't know. I just don't want to be like everybody else. So this year I'm going to try and mix it up and not be like everybody else. But I got a bunch of these. It's glittery in the black parts. I don't know if you guys can tell. But I got a bunch of these. I think I got like five of these because I'm not for sure how full I need to make this mesh and ribbon wreath. I also got like six or eight of this just plain black mesh. And then I got the wreath form. I also got these ties to go for my little mesh wreath. I got the orange and the black and they are very shiny. Super cute. I also, I wanted to go kind of plain with the black mesh and just a little bit of sparkle in this ribbon because I want to add like glittery stuff to it. I don't think I'll add these because they're more of a goldish orange, but how cute are those? I love those. I can also use these in this little wiry looking iron looking pumpkin that I have that you can fill it with stuff and lights so I like this I also went to Goodwill slash thrifting the other day and I got some really cute stuff like including this shirt I thought about doing a haul but I got this little 
wire looking. I think it's an apple, but it has the prettiest filler, like potpourri type stuff in it. But I thought I could switch it out for some fall filler like this. I also just got some plain vase filler so I could put in my clear vases for like a centerpiece. And I thought I would maybe use these. They do come on little black sticks, but I'll just take them off. But I thought I could use those on my wreath. And then I also got one of these little spiders. It's pretty big. I got one of those. I thought maybe I could put somewhere on the reef. I'm not real for sure, guys. And the last two things I got were... Um, little pieces to kind of decorate my kitchen. I do like to get the oven mitts and um, like the dish towels and stuff from Dollar Tree. Usually only for like decor. Like they're not very good quality. But I decided to go with this little theme. And it just says Happy Halloween. I really like that. And the dish towel is the same thing. But I just thought I would decorate my kitchen. I'm going to try and find everything that matches this. They only had these two things out, but I'm going to try and find anything that matches this so I can decorate my kitchen up because that's the main door that everybody walks into is my kitchen door. Um, they don't use like my other front side door or the back door or the garage door, but they all usually walk um, in through my kitchen door, so I really want to make that something that's festive. But yeah, you guys, that is everything for my Halloween Dollar Tree haul. I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to give this a like. Share if you are a Dollar Tree lover, because I love Dollar Tree. Oh, so many people love Dollar Tree. You can make some really good stuff using Dollar Tree products. Love it. But yes, I'll see you guys in the next one.